Home City thinks outside the box with a well-rounded facility that is the first of its kind in the state. And as Steve White reports, the new dome is more than a gym. It's a shelter qualifying for federal funds. It's not your typical basketball gym as Central City goes under the dome. Oh my goodness. This mom. This is like just as good as a college. Can't believe it. That's facility. Awesome. Holy buckets. This is awesome. Central City's new gym is much more than Donette Van Pelt expected. This is amazing. It is like state of the art. I, I was shocked when I came in here. A wide open space. You know, it almost has that arena feel. A facility unlike any around. We are the first in the state of Nebraska to do a monolithic safe room dome structure. And the words safe room are key, qualifying it for federal funds. And when you have that alternative money that comes up, you use it. Jeff Jensen played college football in a dome, but can't take credit. No, this wasn't my idea. I mean, we're, we're the ones that took the baton and got to the finish line, but uh, no, this is a crazy board member at two o'clock in the morning that needed to go to bed. That school board member figured out how to build something voters had rejected, as FEMA covers more than half of the $7.7 million price tag. You know, $4 million coming to Central City, Nebraska is almost like winning the lottery. The Bison Activity Dome can seat around 2,100, far more than their old gym, which will allow them to host district meets yeah, they couldn't yeah. handle before. We never would have dreamt that we'd have anything like this. And it even doubles as a tornado shelter, so that's even another plus. Around 2,800 could take shelter in the reinforced concrete structure. It opened to kids this week and will host its first events in December. In addition to FEMA funds, the community stepped up with 750,000 raised. It doesn't come at the expense of academics. That was part of an earlier phase that has seen nearly every inch of the campus overhauled. For little central city Nebraska, this is pretty, pretty awesome to have in our community. So the superintendent says they've had so much interest. They're being asked to present the concept to other school leaders in Nebraska. Reporting in Central City, I'm Steve White.